color is this, Nicole? Well, well, there's colors hidden inside. Yeah. There's lots of different colors, aren't there? Mm -hmm. So even though it looks like a black pen, believe it or not, if we take all of our crayons and we mix them together, what color do we get? Black. We get black. So uh. let's show everybody at home what they're going to need. First of all, you're going to need to have a vis-a-vis -vis pen or a water-soluble pen. So sometimes Crayola ones will work well. Okay. This is a flare pen, so but it has to be water-soluble. Okay. okay? And right. then we're going to need some filter paper. So that's what these are here, right here. So this is just filter paper. You could use coffee filter, but if you've got a science teacher in your life, or you can find when the filter paper is going to work a little bit better. Actual filter paper. And that'll be yours. Oh, and so you. here's right. what you're going to do is you're going to take the pen and you're going to draw some dots on the filter paper. So we'll show everybody kind of what this looks like. We're just putting some dots right here like this. Ready? And Nicole, you can kind of work on yours right there so you have a little bit more on yours as well. So some pretty heavy dots. It looks like it's black, but if you take all the colors and you combine them together, you get black. So we're going to use a technique called chromatography to get it apart. Chromatography. Okay? Chromatography. Say right. that at the next little party you're invited to, all right? <laughs> so here's what we're going to do. We're going to take the pipe cleaner like this and we dip the pipe cleaner down inside. What do they call them now? They're not called pipe cleaners. They're called oh, they're not? Chanel. So I don't Are know. Are they really? Oh. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't yeah, know. I, when I was in teaching school, it was called pipe cleaner. And uh, then you push right. it through like this, and now you put it inside, and you allow the water to start to wick its oh, it way up. Oh, it wicks out onto the filter Is that paper. fun? Yeah. So it's going to start to wick itself out, and I want to show you what it looks like when it's all done. So when it's all done, would you look oh, at that? Oh, look at that. So that's actually the black pen. Is that from four black dots? Yeah, it's from four oh, black dots. So what colors are in there, Nicole? Yellow, um, pink, yeah. blue. All those. Oh, yeah. And what was How the secret? What, what was it? Water. Yep. And what do those water molecules do? Um, they make them all run away from each other. That's a great way to explain uh, it. I couldn't think are. of a better way. Excellent. So it's water soluble. There's a story that kids are reading um, in kind of first grade called Purple, Green, and Yellow by Robert Munch. And it's a little girl who draws on herself, so I know that's really good for kids at home to hear. And uh, But it washes off until she gets to the Sharpie pen. That doesn't wash off uh. anymore. The super indelible never come off till you're dead, maybe longer coloring marker. All right? Okay. So this is what's happening here. All We're right. going to speed this up a little bit and do spin art. So right. show everybody what we found at the store. What is that? A fan. That's a fan. So it's one of those little fans that has the rubber blades on right. it. Right, okay. So here's what I did is I took uh, just a, a, a top from a container, a plastic container, and I put it here. So here's what's going to happen. This is the best part. Okay. You just put this on top like okay. this. Got it? And Nicole, right. you can use yours right here. Okay. So this right. one's going to be okay. yours. Yeah. Got it? And now um, you can do this. So you turn it on. So you ready? We open up your pen, Nicole. There you go. Let's turn that on, and we're going to throw it in like this, all right? So we'll put it on, and let's do this so that people at home can see. We're going to kind of spin it like this so we get oh, some color that. that's oh, here. Oh, cool. Okay? So that's good. So that's our black. All and right. then we get our eyedropper, Nicole, and let's try this. So our little one that's here, we're going to use this one. So now watch what happens on the camera. So you can see right there, I'm going to put it right in the very middle here. So when you start to spin like this, watch this. As you start to spin, oh, you get this beautiful this. little spin oh, art. Oh, isn't that and now a when cool you're done, deal? Not only did you get to throw ink all over the place, but you get this beautiful Look spin art. Is that the fun? Color. How good and show is them that? all. We've got all these different examples that are here of all the different kind of spin arts.